What I bring to you today is Nick's importery carving techniques, people and sensory carving. There are many manifestations of figural landscapes. There are also a lot of pictures. Today I only choose one of them, a figure of fishing alone in the winter snow. I'm going to demonstrate and explain to everyone. First of all, Let's take a look at the sensory of a struck looked man in a boat on river clad in snow. It's many reflex. Man in a coral raincoat fishing along by the cold river. If we want to show such a picture, there are several elements in it. Next, I will explain to you while demonstrating. In order for everyone to observe clearly, we paint the entire surface of the blank with a layer of ink. Just now we also talked about the element of fishing alone in the winter snow is fishing first, fishing alone, cold river. Then it has these elements. We can think of a boat. There is a man fishing by the river, and remember the cold river. Then the plant next to it should be red, so it can't be too lush for some plants when we are carving. First of all, we have to determine these elements of it. First, when we want to carve, we first carve a boat. Carve the hull first. We usually only carve half of the hull. Then we draw the dock of the ship. No figure has appeared yet. A figure is sitting on the boat. So next, we are going to portray a figure. Pay attention when portraying figures. It has a figure structure. There are body, head, and hands. Let's press this hand first. Then to the head of the figure. His body. Hand stretched forward, holding a fishing rod. This fishing rod stretch is forward. It's higher than the stretch forward. After taking this boom, we can portrait. Below the boom is its hanging wire, fishing line. We simply carve it. Next is to express the feeling of this water surface. Express the feeling of the water surface. The hull part has a reflection. We also simply show the feeling of the water surface. Generally, we don't show the stones so meticulously. Maybe it's leaning on the shore and so on. With a man holding a fishing rod by the river. Then there are some rays along the river. We need some rays. Detail of the rays. We want to show the flower of the rays. Because rays grow in different directions, we have to have different directions. Read basically we express it clearly. Next, let's portrait the boat here. We need to add a little more. Cabinet. 
The whole picture is basically finished like this. Then let's take a look at the finished product. When you sculpt by yourself, pay attention to clear the composition first. Bolt, boatman, then boom. Finally, the rays on the shore. Express all these elements. Then everyone can do it. Then everyone can do it yourself on your own mud. Have a piece of this work.